Hey everyone, want to feature a particular brand in my collection? We'll feature BMWs this time. I have over 60 BMWs, so starting with the early cars, the 328s, 507, the Isetta, which interestingly enough, the Isetta was the front of it was based on a production refrigerator, <laughs> which is pretty funny. And famously, this is also known as the Urkel car. It was featured in Family Matters. Certainly quirky. More BMWs. I have them in semi-chronological order. The E12. The first sort of almost supercar. First real M car, the, the M1. The E28 or E24, I forget. The 6 Series knows the Shark knows. This is the 635 CSI by AutoArt. The, six thir the M6, uh, also by AutoArt, the E30 M3, Z1. I have a bunch of E36 cars, largely because of UT. So the base, E36, E36 M3, and what's that called? Uh, Daytona Yellow, an Estrol Blue convertible. Then we have the Z3s. I have a lot of Z3s because I actually have a Z3 M Roadster. So that's the base Z3. The Z3M in red. The E36 slash 8 is the designation of the coupe. Z3 coupe. Z3M coupe. The Z8. E46s. Both sedan. E46 M3. E46 compact by Kyosho. A Kyosho E60 uh, 545. E61, I think, was the designation of the the wagon here, that's the M5 wagon, Bengal era, 7 series by Kyosho, E90 um, M3, that's resin by Auto, the sedan. I'm not good with the platform code of, code of the 1 series, but uh, let's see, E80 something, I think that is, yep. <laughs> the, uh, I think it's the F12 M6, the X4, which was not a good-looking car. That's an F series. That's an F30 3 series. The G80 or G82, actually M4. And we have a I8. This video is turning into a quiz of my off-the-cuff knowledge of platform codes. F82. No, what do they call these? Um, for the M2, I forgot the platform code for that as well. I'm really failing you guys. Uh, M6 and M5. I think these were G, G10 M5. Does that sound right? And a X6. So that's it for BMWs in the main collection. We have a couple BMW outliers. We've got this neat little old school BMW auto art, which was. I think like a parts delivery vehicle, which is just really neat. It's one of my favorites. We have a couple 112 scale cars, an auto uh, E36 M3. Estrol is my favorite BMW color. I had a BMW in that color. Kyosho Z4. What was that? I think that was that an E85? I think those were E85s. Uh, let's see, what do we have over here? This BMW, not much. We do have this Alpina. I recently reviewed that. E38 7 Series. Let's see, over here, we have a one to one UT of my M Roadster on a scale Ben Pack lift, which I have in the garage on scale BBS LMs, which are the reels on my one-to-one. -one. Uh, my car is, I'll feature a video on it one of these days, but it's it's working its way towards 600 wheel horsepower. I have a couple BMW race cars in here. There's one, a Dakar X5, another E36 car. In this room, got a few more BMWs. We have a racing M1, which was neat. It kind of came with uh, additional Marlboro stickers because 
God forbid we show smoking paraphernalia related advertising. Let's see, got a couple BMWs in here somewhere. We have an E46 M3 race car. And let's see, more BMW, more BMW. Looking for up oh, the iNex concept. Kind of a weird looking thing. We've got the Koenig 8 series, which what was that? The E30? Some what was it? E31, some weird platform code, I forget. Man, I really should have done my homework. Another BMW concept. E89, I think, was the platform code for the Z4 in that generation GT3 car. We've got a, was it, E21 generation Alpina. And that's it there. We've got the James Bond Z3. So again, that's an E36.7 is the Z3 platform. And just a few more over here. We've got the BMW Turbo concept car, another E46 touring car, and because I have it bad, I mean, I have the real car, so that's a stock E36-7 Z3M Roadster. Well, so that's it for my BMWs. I'm going to be doing more videos like this where you get to see in detail some collections within my collection. Hope you liked it. Tune in, like, and subscribe.